This is the current revision of the candy ball or peppermint candy puzzle. The problem I'd had with the previous revision was that the pieces were too flexible, which allowed too much movement that wasn't intended. Now the shell is made of two pieces, and this white area is actually part of the same shell as the red area. And as you can see, the division line forms a little S shape. On the other side, this ball sticks out. This is actually a dome on this side, and this side, this is actually the, the maneuverable ball part. And the goal is to open the puzzle. Now the ball also has an S-shaped cut, but when you try to line it up, it doesn't match. The actual opening is a little bit more subtle. However, the next peculiar feature of opening it is, isn't strictly enforced, but instead of trying to twist it around, it helps to try to push the piece down and allow it to naturally descend, like here, just letting gravity do it. And that allows you to take out the two ball shapes that are inside the shell. In fact, I can put the shell back together. There's a hollow in there where the ball would go, and this is the two-piece ball.